very uh you like you like to get into the in, in, into the into the battles into the drama into the into the tell us a little bit about uh yeah what's up <laughs> I'm gonna just go right into it. Blondie Ferdinand, I, if I pronounced her name right. What, what's your beef with her? Like for the people that don't I'm know sorry. your situation, it's not working. <laughs> what is your What is your situation with her? With who? Wait, we gotta pause. We gotta pause. With, uh, pause with Blondie. Is she on there? <laughs> Let's bring that back. Yeah. The, the headphones keep falling off. You want to get it on top of the half? Yeah. Let's try it. Yeah, because I don't want her doing that on camera. My little. Cute setup is not working now. It looks good. It looks good. No, no, no. Pick up the hat first. Oh, right. There you go. There you go. You put it under and the back. Put oh, the hat on. Yeah, that. <laughs> I think I turned it. Technically, you don't need a hat. The hairstyle looks really good. No, I like that. It looks good without the hat. It does. It you looks are, very good. You, you think it's better without the yeah, hat? I think so because with the hat and the headphones, it, it gives it a little bit of a. Yeah. Hold on. Let's try. Ooh, let's see. Only one, only one way to find out. So, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, 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 no. We know you swag it's already. Let's keep the hat right there. Boom. Yeah, keep the hat right there. Keep the hat right there. I think the hat was hiding the beautiful yeah. face, though. For then, real? Yes. yes. Them that lashes. Yes. Yes. Damn. Yes. Damn. Right now, here's the So, I'm live here, guys, on my page. So, I want to say hi to my fans that are watching. Hey, fans. What's going on, everybody? Everybody good? Live platinum. All great fans. What's up, everybody? Hey, hi, how you doing? Mic check, one, two, one, two. <laughs> you sound good. Thank you. You've done this before. Yes. No, first time. <laughs> uh, Ready? <laughs> All right, Andy. Music. Yes, yes, yes. Welcome back to BTS Miami. As always, your favorite radio station and podcast to listen to. I go by the name of Dash's Clay, and as always, I'm here with my two beautiful co-hosts. Miss Layla Gray. Your favorite life coach, Carla D. And we have an amazing celebrity guest. Yes. As always, and without further ado, we would like to introduce Miss Flo Florence. For the people that don't know you, is yeah. it Florence Dure or is it Florence Luce? Like, what Lawrence do you prefer? To, Luce. So, what is, where does Duray come in? Like, what, why, why, do, why, why did I find both of those? Duray is my marriage name, it's my husband name. Oh, okay. My handsome yeah. husband yeah. over there. Yeah. 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 He was married, he was high. Yes, okay. and my husband is there. Hi, husband. How are you? Hello, husband. Okay, Hello. So, yeah. so the artist's name is Florence El Luce. So, is it husband El Luce? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> you got Joe. So, so, why Florence El Luce? El Luce means that? fight. And for some reason, I went to Puerto Rico, I guess, about um, three years ago. And while I was in Puerto Rico, I decided to change my name to Florence El Luce without even knowing the meaning. Mm. And then now I went and Googled what does El Luce mean, and I found out there was is fight. Yeah. Well, Damn. I mean, yeah, it makes sense. I did some Googling too, so. Oh, you did? <laughs> <laughs> Why you like to call yourself that? Yeah. <laughs> we've, we've we've seen a lot of drama going on. Uh huh. Between you and Wandi, do you want to tell us a little bit about that? What's going on there? Um, it's not really drama. It's just the ex employee that you know. Oh. Ex employee. So you used to work for her. She used to work for you. No, she used to work for me. Got you. Oh. <laughs> Was it at one of your businesses or? Yeah, Sorette Cosmetics. I own a um, cosmetic company, but I really don't want to go there. I really don't want to talk about gotcha. that drama. Uh, so the, 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 your entrepreneur says, what are, you, what, are you, what are your businesses or what are you getting into like, besides cosmetics, I guess? I have different businesses. I own a restaurant, which is La Fouchette Restaurant, is in Miami. Um, I have a tax services, which I, which I provide immigration services. I do tax services and I help out 
in different ways that, I, you know, in ways that I can help my community. And it's called DeRay Tax Services. And it's in Miami as well. So how did, how did you get to being an artist? You know, that's a, that's a pretty crazy life. I know the pretty <laughs> crazy yeah, three sixty, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, definitely. Like I do taxes and I rap. I know. I mean, I've always loved to rap. I always loved music and everything. But you know, it fell on my lap. I'm just gonna take it and go with it. Yeah. How do you, How do you have time to do all this? Because it, lo- it looks like you're doing, you're doing a lot. lot. I am doing a lot, and right now I'm so tired. I'm so exhausted because I, I was in my office for the whole day. But I do have help. I have my husband help. I have my mom's help. My sister's help, and I also have a nanny. So you know, I have an assistant. So I had to create a team. Mm-hmm to you know do different things for me when i'm out and busy doing other things and so seeing that you have so much going on like how how long have you actually been doing been in the rap game like how long have you been doing this it's brand new ah. it's brand new how like, brand new? like yeah. months years What's days time? like i could say about a year but um i've were you like smoking weed and then like you started freestyle and somebody was like, man, you should No, rap. no, no, no. Yeah. The first time I actually rap and did a song, which I don't know where did the song go, it was in my pizzeria. I used to own a pizzeria, Munchies Pizza. What have you not done? For real. Wow. I do everything, honestly. Okay. So that's when I did my first song, and I, I I remember I was aiming at Nicki Minaj, talking about real ass, real tits, I ain't no Barbie bitch. So, you know, that's the first time I actually stood in a studio to do a song. And I guess it ain't go nowhere. But now I have the opportunity, you know, to deliver something to my fans. So it's, you know, I grabbed it and Mm -hmm. give it a shout now. For the people that don't know, like, fans from what? Like, because clearly it wasn't fans from, like, Pizzeria or something like that. Of course. It's fans from Facebook. Got you. I have a lot of fans, which I call my nations. Shout out to my nation that's watching right now. Flow Nation, I love you so much. I have a lot of fans. And when I tell you I have a nation, I have a nation. What is your following like? Um, right now I have like um, 242,000 followers on Instagram okay, okay. and um, Facebook. It's approximately 121, but when I do a live, I get approximately 18 to 20,000 views while I'm live. Yeah, what, yeah okay. so, so people listening. So yeah. would you people call yourself them. an influencer? Yes. Okay. Yes, definitely. An influencer capitalizing on the success and becoming an artist. like. Uh, we see so many influencers now that like will come uh, that will have like a, a large following and will kind of just say to themselves like you know what I'm just gonna take advantage of this and kind of start doing music and to be honest with you not all of them are that good mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying so is it like something that you were like more I'm getting I'm good at music or more I I'm gonna capitalize on this I think I'm good at music did you hear my song uh, but I don't understand all of the music, no, not but too much. When it comes to music, it's a feeling. You don't need to understand. I, just I like mean, when I'm, I'm listening, not, I'm, just like when I'm listening to uh, um, Spanish songs, no, no, I have the feeling, you know, mm-hmm. that that bachata thing going on. It's like, yeah, yeah. I, I feel it. You know, you, you need yeah. to feel it. When it comes to music, you, you feel seem it. Like a really nice girl for me. It just didn't seem like the type of music that I would listen to, to be honest with you. For That's real, my only thing. a lot of people say that. Yeah, I get that a lot. I get that but a lot. It's, it's, Listen, if it's if it floats your boat, you know, <laughs> yeah, keep, keep rocking. Exactly. Who who's your musical inspiration? Like, who who was somebody that you got growing up that you were like, man, I, I love. I don't know. I mean, I love a lot of different artists. I, growing up, I used to love Britney Spears. Mm-hmm. Gotcha. Same. Me too. Okay. <laughs> you too, right? <laughs> I'm a Britney fan. Okay. <laughs> and yeah. then after that, when everybody else was coming in, you know, I liked Trina. Mm-hmm. I did like Nikki. Are you born and raised in Miami? No, I was born in Haiti. I grew up in Haiti for about 11 years, then I moved to Miami since then. So I went to middle school here, North Miami Middle School. Then I went to North Miami Senior High. So you're a Miami. I'm a Miami girl. (laughs) So you mentioned you said you did like Nikki. Yeah. Don't like Nikki. I mean, I do like Nikki. I'm sorry. I love Nikki. But you said your first (laughs) rap was a battle to her. To her. At the time, you you know, I was pretty young. Yeah. Do you like Cardi? I love Cardi. I mean, like, I love everybody's butt. <laughs> <laughs> so who wins? Who wins the, the the your favorite, Cardi or Nicki? Um, you know what? They're different. But you, gotta it, you get you can only get a feature from one of them. Only if one. I, 
Hmm. And it's gonna be a diss to the other one. Oh. Damn. Damn. Yes. I think I would pick Cardi. We gonna diss Damn. the queen. Oh. Yeah. Okay, El Luce, you living yeah. up to that name. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm living up to the name. <laughs> we don't, we don't, we don't do the queens over here. Gotcha. <laughs> but if you had to choose, that's what it would be. I mean. Uh, we had to diss, it'll be Cardi. Right, yeah. Right. So who who does Florence listen to on a regular? Like if you had to choose anybody, who is who are you listening to? Honestly, I love my Haitian artists. So are you talking in general or are you going straight? Like American? what's on your playlist? You get in the you know, car. Like who are you listening to? She I listen to my Haitian artists. I listen to you know, Kai, I listen to Vibe, I listen to other things, but I do have um Nikki. Okay. <laughs> Do you listen to uh, Roberto Cave? Who's that? Oh, no, man. Richard. Richard. She said Richard. Cave. That's what I said. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Roberto. I know. I know. I know. Cave. <laughs> yes, I do. Yeah. I do. <laughs> do we? Do we? We found our group. <laughs> right. Somebody had to fill in for <laughs> To the rescue, Dashes. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Great job. Yeah, but I do listen to Richard Cave. That's the first one I mentioned. We met him, we he's, met him he's last here. week. Super dope guy. Yeah. yeah. Seems super talented. I love him. He's, he's Kai. He's His bi- band bi- name is Kai. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah, that's yes. That's so that's that, that was the first one I mentioned. You said it, and I was like, wow, I know Creole music. Kai, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. And I listen to New Look. You know, you know, I was a model in You Look Video. I was a model in Diffo, so yeah. and Posib. So I listen to all my Haitians. You know, that's the first thing. When I get into my car, I do listen to my yeah. Haitian artists. Then I listen to Future, like um, yeah. Future, Cardi, mm-hmm. you know, and everybody else. Cool. The American stuff. The American so you're real stuff. versatile when it comes to your music. I'm sorry? I said you're real versatile when it yes, comes to your very, music. Yes, very, 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 very diverse. I think that kind of goes across the board with you because you're a model, actress. Mm-hmm. I mean, you, you're, you're, you're doing so much. She's yes. Serious. Like, yeah. how, how does it happen? You're doing so much. I don't know. For some reason, my brain is always working. Okay. I don't even sleep. Mm. I can't sleep because my brain is always functioning. It's always oh, doing something. I'm always work. thinking about something new. Mm-hmm. I'm always thinking about coming up with something new. It's like I, I don't feel comfortable if I'm just sitting out there and not doing anything. I agree. That makes so sense. Yeah. I really want to touch everything. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Do you find yeah. challenges in what you're doing, like in, in becoming a musician? Yes, I do. Like, what are your biggest obstacles that you think to like? That you have to like basically. I mean, you're a new artist, so you're gonna have to defend yourself. You're gonna have mm-hmm. to make a name for yourself in the mm-hmm. in the music world because just because of you're course. a successful model or entrepreneur, it doesn't mean that they're gonna, gonna be accept welcome. me yeah, exactly. exactly. And gotta, that's one of my challenges because you know sometimes they tell you you can't sing, you can't rap, you can't do this, you how can't do that. How do you deal with that? Um, honestly, I don't give a damn. But is music mm. something that you it's really just care about? I do care about music. I really love music. That's doing, something I really love. You're doing so much. What do you think is your main? What is your main focus? What do you think is your true passion? My true passion is really business. Word. Okay, it's business. I'm a straight up business woman, so but I love. I'm a boss bitch. Ah, hey. that's it. <laughs> but I really love music mm-hmm. because at one point. Um, I think I was about 22. I was managing an artist, and he was a rap Creole artist. So he was rapping. His, his name is Big Fa. Mm-hmm. And I nah. was managing Shut him. Up, Big Fa. No Big Fa. You know okay. Big Fa? I do know Big Fa. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah, so I did manage him at one point. Okay. I was always into music, but I see myself as a leader, you know, someone that can guide you, you know. To, to to be successful, mm-hmm. you know. I like to make artists. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know, have you I like. Yes, I have. What do you feel about uh, performance or recording? What's better? What's for you? What's more? Honestly, recording was easier for me. <laughs> Way yeah, easier yeah, for yeah. me. But performing is a whole lot of different ball game. Completely, mm-hmm. I was super shy. You know, it, uh, I was scared. Super scared. But I think I'm good now. Okay, okay. so you over those butterflies. Yes, yeah, I'm yeah. over those. I think I could do it now. Like, you know, you know. Are you still know. acting? Uh, yeah, I am. In my videos. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Oh, my God. So no yeah. acting projects coming up? 
Nah. Okay. And what about, do you have like any new shows, any new music coming out? Like what's, what's new for you? What's fresh? Well, I do have new music coming out and mm -hmm. I do have new shows coming out. I want to do my own reality show. Okay. Is it going to yes. be here in Miami? It is going to be here in Miami and also when I travel. Because okay. I hang out with girls that, you know, my staff is dope. Okay. Okay. My staff it is dope. So is it, is it more like a day in the life of you? A flow. Yes. Gotcha. It's like, yeah. And then I have my nation, my close flow nation that I want to bring into my, you know, to my trips mm -hmm. where I can expose them and give them credit, you know, and also help them create a business. You know, I, there's a lot of things that I want to do in my show to gotcha. help women. Got you. Okay. So seeing that you want to help women, do you like network with any other women like down yes. here in Miami? Do yes. you have your own like? Yes, group? yes, 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 I do. I'm down to network. Just like um the other day I was at the um Love and Hip Hop um show that they were doing a party for Amara and everything. I okay. have very close friends, you know, that's that knows them and I was like, Listen, you should go and network with Trina, network with other people and I was there. I was actually there and I networked and for some reason they really love how my appearance when I pulled up, you know, I was okay. all, all, you know, okay. I was looking like a billion dollar bitch. So next so. season? Love <laughs> hip hop next season? <laughs> That's what I was going to I ask. don't know yet. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, I was there and I did talk to a few people. I did um, network and I'm, you know, I'm up for that. Okay. Yeah. And so Love and Hip Hop comes to you. We want you to do the show. Yes or no? Hell yeah! <laughs> 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 we get so many, every time we ask that, I feel like we get a completely different, different. answer. Yeah. It's true. We do. Like, said, like, and yeah. it's like, it's like, it's, it just goes A, B, A, B, A, B, like the first person, yes, second person, yes. no. Yes, why not? Third person, yeah. <laughs> you, look lit. You, you look like you're very entertaining. Yes, I am. I am. And I got a lot of drama, too. So I think, <laughs> um, right. you know. I, I think I think I, I think my husband and I can bring a lot of drama ourselves. <laughs> Got it. So what, That's a real behind the scenes. Next, next, next. Like, what's the next main focus, goal, project? What's going on? Yeah, I'm really working on another single, another hit, mm -hmm. another gotcha. hit. I'm really focusing on another hit because one thing I realized with music, you have to have a lot of passion, a lot of love for music. You know, you have to take it serious. It's not a joke. Okay, it's not something to play with because there's already artists out there that's working so hard, that's pushing themselves, you know, mm -hmm. and for me to have the, you know, for me to have the fan base, because I was trending on YouTube when I released my first video. Okay. I was trending number 27. Nice. On Congrats. YouTube. Wow. Thank, you. Yes, Thank you. Thank you. And on the first day or two, I think I had about 300,000 views as a beginner. I can, mm. you know, I'm a new artist, so it's something to really think about. It's not a joke. You have people that are expecting things from you. You have people that are waiting, you know, so you have to satisfy the needs. So you really have to put a lot of love. Are you only doing music in, in Creole? No, I'm going to do music in English as well. Gotcha. Yes. Okay. Yes. Cool. Um, social medias, let people know where to find you. How can they... Uh, contact you how can they look for your new music where do they go how can they stay updated yeah facts. yeah my yeah. new single you find it on my youtube channel which is florence el luce mm -hmm. and my instagram is florence deray and my facebook is florence el luce you can follow me you can um do whatever subscribe like sure. comment Unlike, don't <laughs> like, <laughs> share, <laughs> whatever you want. As Join long yes, the nation, as okay? long as I get that view, I yes. really don't care if you talk shit. I really don't <laughs> care whatever you do. I appreciate the view. Yes. that's it. Just that's give me the view. The views add to dollars. Right. There you go. Yes. You heard it here behind the scenes, Miami. Boss. Facts, facts. Well, we appreciate you taking the time out of your busy schedule yes. and. Uh, Ooh. Thank you for coming by. Hopefully when you release Thank your next you. single, your next video, you stop by again. 
You got to come back. Thank you. Yeah, and I need back, your back. I need your support, guys. Oh, we got you. you okay? Got I'm at approximately 800,000 views in one week. I need 200 more thousand okay. views you. on YouTube. So, so you guys are working in, on it. So make, make sure, sure it yes, out there. make sure you put it out there. Make sure you continue yeah. to support my fans. Continue to watch the video. I would appreciate it a lot. Please, please, please continue to get a video up because I've done views. As always, this is Behind the Scenes Miami. My people be platinum. Yes. Yes. Bye. Thank you. Dale. Popsicle. Come on. That was awesome. Awesome. Oh, my God. Good job. Yes, mommy.